us go there. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Alright, don't send it up. We done? We are done. That was nothing. <laughs> that was my one criteria. I, we had to have the vaccine and I still feel the students need to wear masks. We all still need to do our part. Of security, yes, to feel that, um, keep that COVID down, keep those numbers down. So I'm gonna give you the uh, Pfizer vaccine, and you're gonna be monitored. Consider us to be essential workers, and we should be some of the first people in line to get the vaccine, especially if they're, they want the schools reopened. You know, it should be a choice. You know, I know some people, um, have health issues or concerns and they may not be able to get the vaccine. That That's understandable, but those who are, you know, able, let us be first. If you want us, you know, to open the school safely, like you're saying. In first grade, I uh, teach math and science. Therefore, it's a hand, I need hands-on things. I need to be able to work with manipulatives and things to actually show them to make sure they're understanding the skills that I'm teaching. Prior to me getting flu shots, whatever, I would always get sick with the kids. Always get whatever they had, I would get it. My mindset was it's better to go in with something versus going in there without having it. I usually get the flu shot every year anyway, so I said I would rather be protected than not. This is a great day for School District 189. Eastside Health District is just great that we could be able to give them the vaccine so that they could possibly get the school started again and open. Uh, this is a great day for the community and we want everybody to remember to get vaccinated and to just come on down when you are assigned a date and a time. But right now we're doing District 189. We'll be here today, which is Tuesday, and we'll also be here Thursday for the other half of the staff to be done so that we can get the school going again. So we'll be back in 21 days to give their second dose. So I don't know exactly what their time schedule is for opening, but at least they will have their first vaccination. I've also done Lovejoy School District and I am scheduling Cahokia School District so that all the teachers are done. Those are the three school districts that I cover.